All right, let's get you some spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird here for you guys. These are general messages. Only take what is for you. Simply leave what is not. Make sure that you're also subscribed to your areas only placements love tarot guys as well all right anywhere Aries is in your chart you could be cross watching for areas as you can and resonate with those messages over there all right these are general so let me take what's for you simply leave what is not sun moon rising venus north node energy third party energy sun moon and rising let's see what's going on with you guys all right oh the queen of wands and the queen of swords Someone here is very attracted to you. Someone here wants to get to know more about you. This could be an authority figure. This could be someone here that wants to have a talk. But you see that white cat? This is innocence. This is purity. Um, um, this person has a nursing alpha norm. Someone here could be into nursing. This also could be about healing something. Hmm. If this is a man, he is in his feminine. This is like a strong conversation. Um, yeah, about how to get, yeah, honey, the king and the queen of wands and temperance and the queen of swords. Someone here wants to put balance back in things. They could want to know if you're single or if you're dating somebody. Someone here could also have you in a third party. Someone here, yes, yeah, someone here could be, have, want to have, it's like, I mean, I don't know if somebody's about to get cut off or what the fuck this is. Nine of Pentacles to the Three of Pentacles. Somebody here could be, ooh, what's that? Yep, the Queen of Wands in reverse. Oh my gosh. The Three of Pentacles and the Ten of Swords. Someone here betrayed an empress for a whore. Whether you are a man or a woman, it don't matter. That's exactly what they did. This is somebody that will give them sex. Someone here, child. Let's just get the overall energy real quick. Yep, the star. Look at this. Queen of swords, queen of wands. Someone here wants to talk to you. But they betrayed you. Somebody here cut you off for a whore. This could have been someone here to be quite honest with you. Don't ask a lot of questions. But satisfy them sexual, like satisfy their sexual desires. Whoever they cut you off for, this person doesn't tell this person no for nothing. That could have been why they cut you off for this person. I know this person is not cutting you off for a whore. I'm just going to be honest. Or a yes woman or a yes man or whatever you guys want to call it. This person doesn't ask questions. This person will do anything sexual for this person. That's why they work with this person. They satisfy their sexual needs, their desires, their wants, their fantasies. They felt like this was more, <laughs> oh my gosh, why did I do this read? They felt like this was more healing for them. Or this would heal them, this person. I feel like this person is finding out that it's not. Because I saw the king of ones, the queen of ones in reverse, and the queen of swords. Other you guys, for others of you guys, that's not going to resonate with the third party situation. This is somebody here that is telling is cutting this off because they're not getting their desires met. They don't feel like you're open enough that you are. They're going to get. They're not getting satisfied. I don't know what the fuck. Someone here could be cutting you off because of the sex. I don't know if they're not getting enough or they don't like it or it's not doing anything i don't know what the fuck is going on so they're going towards like somebody got this empress and it's king of cups
You will, the Empress, Queen, someone here also, oh my gosh, this fucking reading. Well, goddamn. I'm hearing that song by Eve. Love is blind, and it will take over your mind. What you think is love is truly not. You need to elevate your mind. Love is blind. Someone here is was is blind about what love is. Someone here, uh, it could have been their idea of love was if I want something sexually, it, it was based upon the principalities of sex. It's like if you love me, you would do it. If you love me, you would have a threesome. If you love me, you would, um, you know, do a sex tape with me. Some shit like that. Fuck. Woo! Shit! We got temperance and the devil. Oh, my gosh. This is a... I got to tell you. Somebody's love language is physical touch. This is not somebody that just doesn't want sex. They need sex. They... They have... This could be something, to be honest, that they have to heal. This could be a codependency. This could be very toxic. So, you know, Empress, whether you are a man or a woman, you could be in your very, you know, feminine, laid-back energy. Um, they struggle with this, but they need it. <laughs> what else? Yep, look at this. The Queen of fucking Pentacles. There's three people here. I can't make this shit up. The Nine of Swords. Someone here is nervous. I feel like this person is nervous about the way they betrayed you. Because it's already done. They already did it. It's like this is something they couldn't fight. I got to be honest with you. Someone here is like they are not in control of their sexual urges. As soon as you start slacking or I'm tired or for some of you guys, this is somebody that did this to you when you got pregnant. Aquarius, Arius, Geminin, uh, Sectarius, Caprion. Virgo, Pisces. Let me tell you something. Or you was that person and had somebody else pregnant. I don't know what what what, what this is. Somebody here. Oh gosh. Now, for some of you guys, when you were pregnant, this could have happened. Or this is when it started. Uh, obviously, when you are pregnant, you can't, you know, maybe you weren't interested as much. Maybe the sex changed. You're fucking pregnant. What the fuck? Or this, or this is what, what they were going through. So you need to put their energies where they go. So if this is what they were going through, they portrayed you because their person was pregnant. So you were the person that was satisfying them sexually, wasn't giving them too much problems, too much uh, grief about sexual desires. Plus you were open to do things for them that they liked. The Queen of Wands and the Three of Pentacles. For some of you guys, like, it, you know, there could have been, like, threesomes, third parties involved. Um, something here is that this could be um, even, you know, like, watching pornos and getting intimate. You know, a, a third party enhancement was here. Um, and it's like they needed it because they wasn't getting it at home. So, you know, if you're this Empress or you're this Queen of Wands in reverse. Queen of Pentacles. I feel like, to be quite honest with you, I feel like the Empress and the Queen of Wands in reverse. I'm sorry, the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles. I feel like y'all were kind of, and the Queen of Pentacles guards innocence and purity. Then we have the Empress energy. I feel like you and this other person was innocent. This person, the Queen of Wands in reverse. This person is also attracted to your innocence. Someone here is into like breaking people open in a sexual manner for them. They look for sweet, innocent people. It turns them on. But now this person is, is nervous. Um, We need to see why they're nervous. 
I need to look at all three of you guys. Uh, this person has a toxic trait, but it keep, they feel like it keeps them balanced. That's why they do it. Um, this is sexual. This is the, you might not know. This person also could have like a, a sex demon. I was trying not to say it, but it, it, it could be what they need healing from. They're nervous about healing from this. I feel like someone here, you know, why do people get nervous about healing? They're not nervous about healing. They're nervous about the changes it could bring in their life and how people would consider them or something. Half of the time, that's what it is. It's like, well, if I heal this, you know, if I, I start acting different, if I do this, then I won't be this. I won't have this. People won't, you know, it, it, it's like people will look at me funny. And that's what they're nervous about as well. So we need to take a look at this. So we got child, we got three, one, nine. Let's see. Let's see. Let's and we'll go a little deeper. All right, guys. Angel number three one nine. It's time for you to make some life changes. Your guardian angel is trying to get your attention and guide you towards a better future. I, this person, to be honest with you, this is somebody that was supposed to be, this person is refusing a change. This is someone that was supposed to have been healed. They were supposed to have been get their shit together, but they're not. You don't know somebody fights with like a, a, a inner demon. Someone here tried to make you a karmic to like their inner demons. They tried to make you a karmic all as well to their situation. This is somebody that um, is battling with something internally. I need to take a look at this, child. This is crazy. This is someone that needs, like, major healing. I, it's like, this could be sexual healing. Like, they need to clean. It's, this is also something in their root chakra. This also could be affecting their physical health. <sighs> What's the Ten of Swords? So this is somebody here, to be honest with you. For some of you guys, they you they portrayed you because you didn't know about an empress. Or you're the empress and you didn't, and you was portrayed and you didn't know about a queen of pentacles. And I feel like both of you guys are innocent behind this person's actions. What's the Ten of Swords? They're nervous about offering you something. Or like, I don't know, like trying to... What's the Ten of Swords? The King of Swords. Yeah. The four of wands. They're cutting off this relationship. Somebody here used somebody because their spouse was unavailable. Their spouse was having a baby. Their spouse, uh, 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 partner, whatever you want to call it. This empress is pregnant. And they, you know, I mean, they could have been going through shit. You know, when a baby comes, a lot of things happen. And they were looking for a feeling. And you were that person. And this is that somebody that takes on anybody. There is something pure. There is something innocent. This you you are someone who had potential on a relationship. That's another reason why. Yeah, the fucking Queen of Pentacles. Oh my gosh. So you were you were chosen. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Queen of it, this is somebody here to be honest. You were somebody. You are the new person. That's what I'm getting. What's the devil in temperance? Now we got to look at this. What's the devil? Five, yep, five of swords, two of wands, and two of pentacles. It was their decision to play this mind game and a motherfucking juggle you. Uh, yep, ten of swords to betray you. That was it. And this is someone, they, it's like they liked you. They had feelings for you. They felt love for you, but they blocked it out on purpose because there was a situation here. Let's see what's going on. I need to see this. Uh, I want to see this empress. You're the queen of pentacles. Or you could be the empress. Yep, king of cups. This person was about to be a, a father. 
This, this, things could have came tough when the babies was about to be born or some shit like that. They were going through shit at home. They wasn't getting sex. Somebody here wasn't in the mood, you know, and they started, they looked, they, they needed to get their sexual desires filled elsewhere. This person needs sex. And it could be because of the sexual heaven that they need is codependent. They could even have some kind of sexual demon and see attachment. That's exactly what this is. I want to... Show me the Queen of Pentacles. Yep, wealth. I was going to say the Empress and then I switched to the King of Pentacles. Y'all are innocent. Let's stick with the Empress. I don't want to flip-flop too much. Yep, uh-uh. King of Cups again. I'm telling you. Boom. This person was about to be a dad. Defeat. Yeah, they were. And they could have been, yeah, oh my gosh. The Prince of Cups. They could have had a little boy. Yep, the magician. Yep, they did. They had a little boy. They manifested a little boy. And we have the Prince of Disc. So this could be someone that got two kids or they had two kids with this person. This could even be twins, how it came out. But they were going through something in their certain situation. It's like, you know, this person could have been like nine months. This is somebody that was almost ready to give birth. Yep, the fool. So they took a chance elsewhere to get their sexual needs met. What's the Queen of Pentacles? I'm sorry. What else is going on in this Empress? What else is going on? I don't know if you this Empress or this Queen of Pentacles. Whether you're a man or a woman. What else is going on here? Say yo. Wedding. They're married to... I told you. This is their counterpart. They were married. This is a married person. Doctor. So they were going to doctor visits and shit. I mean, they could have been showing up for this person's life was still supportive. But at the time, they could have been through like a separation. They wasn't having sex. They wasn't doing shit. We got money. Yup. And conversations. And they are there also was. Yeah, I told you they were supporting this person. But this, but something, this person, it's like they, they couldn't get sex at that time. Yeah. They freed yourself. Now, for some of you guys, this ended. Yep, this ended. They're not even with this person no more, for some of you guys. Yep, that's your confirmation right here. They're not even with this person no more. So this is what was going on when they met you. They had somebody that got pregnant. They could have even been married or separated. Maybe you didn't know that. They could have split up during a pregnancy. And they were looking for somebody shit to get their kicks off. And it was you. And you were not. And this wasn't anybody, honey. You were chosen. You fit their description. Somebody here needs somebody that's sweet, innocent, and has some kind of purity. I mean, this could have been what they wanted you to be to them, give to them. They wanted you to be somebody here like a sweet, innocent, naughty girl. That's how they looked at you. Or boy. What's this? Yep, equilibrium. That's what they was thinking. <laughs> oh, shit. Ooh, exploration. Oh, my gosh. So that's why they traveled towards you. That's You were chosen. The Queen of Swords. It's here again. Yep, that's why they chose you. They was watching you. They had their eye on you. And it was like, yeah. But a brat in a tower. This is also someone, to be honest with you, uh, it's like they denied their feelings. Death card. Yep, it, it's like it ended, though. This had nothing to do with feelings or love. Show me something else on the Queen of Pentacles. This is someone here that has love for you. I, I got to be honest. You guys already know I ain't going to lie to you, baby. We live, love, cry here together with spiritual nourishment. What else is going on with this Queen of Pentacles? Yep, the main, I'm telling you, the main female. This was not to be in a relationship. They were going to let you think that, though. Yep, Mercury thoughts. I can't make this shit up. I can't make it up. They were going to let you think it. Yep. Reunion. Oh. Now, this is also somebody. Now that this is completely done over here, they want to come back to you. But it's the kind of energy that you have. It's 
Damn. What's the Queen of Wands in reverse? What's the Queen of Wands in reverse? Ooh, 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 this is crazy as hell. Fortune. Deception. Yup. That's this fucking person. This is also somebody here that could have had a lot of money, gained a lot of things, something like that. Yep, they want to call truce. Oh my gosh. This, this is a situation that started off one way and is ending up another because they're not with this person no more. So now they're thinking of, well, maybe they should just come towards you. You are the queen of pentacles. You know, maybe there's still something here. There's still some connection. I mean, after all, I did have love for you, but it's after they used you. Oh, my gosh. Let's see what this person's feelings and emotions is towards you, child. And let's see what they want to see. That's what this is. You a star. We have different love languages. I'm telling you right now. For some of you guys, this person's love language is physical touch. They need sex. And when it was denied, it could have been denied to them in a certain pregnancy they was with somebody. And it's like, it it it, 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 it also ended that relationship, to be honest with you. I love our late night pillow talks. It turns me on. Um, This person misses talking to you. Y'all could have had deep conversation. The Queen of Pentacles has something to offer. Um, Gives you also something to think about. This is wild. Because now this is somebody that wants to like, Reconnect with you because this is um, completely done. This person doesn't pick anybody. You were picked for a reason. That's why they want to come back. Ooh, shall. What else is going on here? The answer is no. I'm ready to be your dope ass husband. This is somebody that wants a connection. Uh, I feel like Whatever your answer is, or if you had any questions, you could have wanted to know, well, do you have somebody? Are you in a relationship? They don't. I've been shopping for rings. No, for real, they don't. Somebody here could, it's like, this is a karmic soulmate. And they're karmic because of the role they chose to play purposely in your life. Because they had somebody else. Y'all do have like a connection here. But they're karmic. Uh, they want to talk to you. Master number 33 also is connected to your throat chakra. But this is what it was. This is what was going on. This is like a clarity reading. You need a clarity. This is to give you clarity. Let's see what this person want to say, child. I'm... What do they want to say? Can I use this deck? Yeah. Yeah. You're their favorite. <laughs> Have my kids. This is somebody here that still could want to have kids. I mean, if they have kids and they get, they want to like kind of see where this connection is going to go now after all, you know, you might have to, you know, play that role with the kids, be around the kids, shout something with the kids. Ooh. Run away. Yup. Run away with me. Nervous. This person is nervous. You hurt me. Focus on money. Yup. I feel like this person knows that they hurt you. Yep, when they gaslit your ass. But they hoping that you would still listen. Why? Because you are specific to this person, whether you know this or not. Someone here specifically chooses their karmics. <laughs> it's like, this person could be like really like a, a organized person. Also, someone that's very like clean, organized, structured. This person could be like a, a OCD person too. I'm, I don't know. It, this shit is like, wow. What's the love oracle message here? What's the love oracle message here? People are like, I mean, it just, I, I don't know. Like, yep, trust. Yo, engagement. Somebody, I, you're the queen of pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles is also a wifey or a husband. That's why they chose you. To even have a karmic, like, energy with. You could be connecting with, like, a water sign, Cancerian, Piscean, or Scorpion. But it's like, now that this ain't working, 
they're come they want to come back because you have value because you have worth this person don't just sleep with anybody it's somebody that could even sleep around a lot but everybody is like picked precisely passion child all I know this person wants to see you again and it was after this situation was is over the answer is no they're not with that person no more what's the letters here mm. yep you got good dharma good karma we got L we got V and we have suburbs. Someone here could live in the suburbs, a city, state, or whatever you guys are in or from. Let's get an oracle message, child. Mm. You wouldn't get, you didn't know what was going on. Yep, they're coming to heal, honey. Heal this broken heart. You ain't know what was going on. You might have felt like, okay, this person sees this about me. They know this. I know this is why they like me. They want me. But it doesn't match up with their actions because they had somebody else. This, but they choose karmics like relationships. Certain people choose karmics because they're a karmic. They just want to sleep with them. That's it. Not this person. You got to still have something. And that's what you do. You still got to have some kind of finesse. Whether you this queen of pentacles or the, or, or the empress, you would know. This person is attracted to empresses and queen of pentacles. Drama. And that's what all this drama is about. This is somebody here that got drama. Uh, yep. The child. Damn. I'm fucking. The past returns for a time. There was two of y'all. Now they just want to yeah, be your true self. Now they just want it to be you and them. They want to be their true self. This could be someone here that's kind of mad, got an attitude as well. Yeah, power, personal growth, transit to the spiritual realm, breaking dawn. Yeah. This is also someone here that's been feeling in their spirit. Mm -mm -mm. You wasn't just like a um, jump off. Even though they treated you that way purposely. They picked you for all your qualities. <laughs> um, maybe they also figure like, you know, someone here le left a, like a, a foot trail back to you or to you in case they ever had to trace back your open. And it looks like they do. That's exactly what this is. What's the size of the planets here? That's exactly what the fuck's going on here, child. Damn. Um, yep. Yeah, uh-uh. Yeah, honey. Fourth house. Ho, oh, this person's coming to your house. They might even need to live with your ass. Passion. And they need to do it. They need both. They need a house and they need sex. They need sex. What is this? Invitation. Yep, they want you to invite them over. They're going to try to get you to invite them over. 42, 43. Yep, 12th house. Pisces. They they feelings. Damn. I got it. Damn it. Woo, oh, we got so change. Pissed off. Because things have changed. Especially in this other situation. We got to source. Yep. South node. Karmic. Pissed. There, there, this is a karmic soulmate. Yep. Messages that wants to connect with you. Child. We have Jibidin here. We have Pisces here. Aqua Aquarius and Cancerian. Water. Strong waters energy. I feel like this is a clarity reading <clears throat> to give you clarity on something that you know. You're like, I don't understand why I can feel. I know all of this. I know they like me. I know why they're here, but not, the actions don't mess. Because they, this was a situation based off another situation. And based off of that situation, it didn't work out. And now this is somebody that wants to come towards you. This is somebody that had a situation. They had. Uh, they were going through something with somebody that they were having a child with. And if you're not resonating with the child part, then take it out. They could have been just going through something with somebody um, here. They could have had kids with this person or, you know, their kids were together or whatever the fuck with this person. And at that time, it was off. For a lot of you guys, this is somebody that was already pregnant. I just got to keep it real with you guys. And it's like you were like their scapegoat. And now you are their scapegoat because now they want you. 
Because this shit didn't work out. The signs was this was already not working out. was already there. To be honest with you. And you can't be a homewrecker if you didn't know. Shout the T. I hope that this uh, clarity helped you out in more than one way, guys. All right. We're going to shut it down right here. Don't forget to hit that bell. Hit all that keeps you tapped in and tuned in and notified when your messages are ready and available for you. I love you all. Stay dope. Next video upload, baby. I'll share it in mine.